We're here today with Craig Wiener, director of Characters. For over 25 years, the Character Group has manufactured and distributed authentic, licensed children's mass retail products throughout South Africa and Africa. They're trusted custodians of many of the world's best loved brands like Disney, Nickelodeon, Mattel. Um, and the Character Group adds fun, fantasy and adventure to the children's everyday lives. What we're talking about today is actually uh, the, the CISPRO solution that CISPRO provided, ERP solution provided to the Characters Group. What were the initial challenges that drove you to investigate an ERP solution? We initially were on an ERP solution, not through CISPRO, um, and we had quite a lot of shortcomings in our inventory management uh, and reporting functions throughout the business where we didn't have um, quite an overview of what was going on and that's what drove us to look at a CISPRO solution. Well, what were the deciding factors for the selection of a CISPRO system? Um, there were two factors. Number one was quite a few licensees and aligned businesses that uh, distribute product, the similar product that we do, uh, use a CISPRO solution. And so we decided to look at it from that aspect. Um, and then the sales and support from the VAR that we had implemented through drove us to look at the solution. When we had first initially chosen the system, we got our VARs in approximately eight to nine months before the implementation went off. We looked at all angles of the business. I was very adamant that I wasn't taking any information from my existing ERP besides for balances and stuff over to the system. So we started loading all general ledgers, all inventory, all facets of the system from scratch, which was a huge help in that we could sort of mold the system to how we wanted it from the get-go. The VARs were coming here, I'd say every day for about six months. Um, and we looked at it from that angle very heavily when we were going through with them and then we got our auditors involved right from around two months to deadline day that we were going live and that was a big help because they sort of got involved with the VAR making sure that everything came through exactly how it was from the old system all the balances came through all of that came through properly so that was a huge help when we finally implemented the system. Which specific areas of your business do you think have benefited from this solution since it was implemented? Certainly our inventory management solution, um, our warehousing and distribution has sort of skyrocketed since we put it in. Um, and on the reporting side, each of our divisional managers and directors has very much an overview of the business. What were the immediate consequences of the implementation for the company? Exact controls over inventory management we knew exactly what stock was coming in, when it was coming in, how it was coming in, and better control of just the different divisions that were sort of operating throughout the business. So from a financial inventory, uh, shipping and logistics, imports, uh, every side of the business sort of uh, has benefited since then. Explain how your inventory management has changed since the system was deployed. Goods as they are booked onto the system at a supplier, um, we know exactly what, um, what's coming in, when it's coming in. We do lots of royalty reporting to different licensing companies, so we can, we can report on products as and when and how they booked at, at supply. Then throughout the whole supply chain, we know exactly what's happening at every supplier. They come into the business via landed cost tracking model. So the margins, costings, all of that is known at time of placing an order, at time of port of shipment out of China, India, Pakistan, wherever the goods are coming from. When they land, we know exactly what's happening with them at the ports in South Africa, Durban to Johannesburg. So as far as that, as the goods come from source to our warehouse, we know exactly at what point they're at. When they land in Johannesburg, we know exactly what bay they're in in our warehouse. If they need to get uh, distributed out to one of our distribution warehouses throughout the country, we know exactly where they are. And then obviously on a costing side, we need to know exactly what margins are coming in from where and that's sort of given us an edge with this system. How has the implementation enabled and empowered and helped senior management in the company? They get daily reports on where and what and how we're trading. Um, on the financial side, um, our directors know exactly what's going on in the business at any given point in time and we're also looking in the longer term to have uh, to have those guys on iPads with their espresso model so they wanting to know what their sales gross margins are at any point in the time of the day because they're traveling quite a lot so they're seeing those sorts of benefits all the time. So we're looking at getting into espresso from January uh -huh. uh, to give our upper directors uh, sort of visibility okay. of the whole business. Yeah. And we're talking to Isaac McKenna, 
who is system operator at uh, the company. You know, how does the current system compare to the one that you had before? We found that with the current system, we more flexible in terms of getting more access to other areas while you're doing one function you can get into the other functions and the biggest um, benefit of it was just the reporting and and the accuracy because obviously starting from uh, moving from an old system we had old information and everything was a bit imbalanced and starting afresh it was so it was just a great benefit to the business and for us uh, it was user-friendly and easy to operate. And sort of looking at some of the more, the more longer-term benefits that you've noticed since the implementation was, was finished? Every month we've added on a different sort of reporting function that's gone through. Um, we're sending quite a lot of our internal staff now onto very technical Excel courses because of pivot tabling and pulling data from the system. They're sort of getting much more involved on that side. Um, and in the longer term, Next year's big focus for us over the next 12 months will be very much streamlining the system to fit in with our processes. So this 12 months was getting to know the system and learning it and over the next 12 to 24 months would be streamlining it. So getting a warehousing, clicking barcoding systems coming in, getting our supply chain to sort of feed into our system. So we're adding on sort of reporting functions and overall inventory management every month. Fantastic. Yeah. Craig Wiener, Director of Characters. Um, thank you so much for joining us sure. today. Sure, thank you very much. Thank you.